Our second video in the virtual learning orientation series will cover the student homepage and the student menu. Here, we are proxying a demo student in grade 11 in the Warren County School District. A few things to note from the main student homepage within the virtual learning system. The first is the announcements. We highly suggest that you check your announcements every day. That way, if a new announcement pops up, you're made aware with the yellow number system. There are three different ways to get to your announcements or your communication. At the top of the menu in the header, under the announcements here, that is specifically located within the homepage tab or in the student menu under communication. Any of the three ways will get to your announcements. When we go into the announcements, you'll see approved flyers from the Warren County School District, field trip opportunities, or just general opportunities within the Warren County School District for all students. Mr. Gettner, our virtual school counselor, and Mr. Vincent, our virtual administrator, along with Mr. Kent, our virtual online coordinator, will often post announcements within the system for students to read to take the place of morning announcements within the home building. In addition to these announcements, your teachers can put announcements within the system that will only show up for students that are within their classes. Notice as you move through the announcements, they will be they will go from bold to normal font and your number of announcements in your tab will decrease as you go through. The three lines is known as the virtual menu. Using the virtual menu can get you back to the student app or the student home screen at any time. If you see the home or the house icon, then you can click here to take you back home. From the student homepage, there are a number of other things that you'll see. First is your student information, which is up in the right-hand corner. Here, you can customize alerts as well as your learning profile. Alerts can tell you when you've submitted assignments, when feedback has been given on your assignments, or when you have something overdue. On the main page, the daily activity is a new feature that's been added this year. If you click here to view your recent daily activity, the user will see all of their activity for the current school week within each one of their enrolled courses, as well as any activity for the past two weeks in all of their enrolled virtual courses. This is a good barometer for you to check if you have been in each one of your classes and working each day as needed. Again, to go back home, I can click on the menu and click on the home icon. Each one of your classes is located on your student homepage with a picture that will show you, give you a general idea of what your course is about, along with your current score in the course and your progress within each course. All Warren County School District students will also have a College and Career Readiness tab. College and Career Readiness is a Pennsylvania mandate in which students are engaging in college and career activities from grades K through 12. Your teachers and Mr. Gettner will direct you when you need to log on to your College and Career Readiness activities and complete assignments associated with your grade level. Before we get into a course, a few more things on the student main page. One is the to-do list. The to-do list will show you the activities that you still have to do along with their due date. Be careful here because some of your assignments may not show up because only graded activities will show up on your to-do list. And in order to score successfully within your graded activities, you need to actually go through the courses and complete the lessons, which I'll show you in our next video. The activity stream will also show anything that's happened within your student application. So when you're uploading work, you can double check to make sure that work has been uploaded here from all of your courses or individual 
courses as you choose. If we click on the courses, this again will take us to our home page. Before we get into actual courses and coursework, under the student menu, a few things to note. One, again, is the communication tab. This will show you your announcements. Your email login, this will give a direct link to Office 365. Your daily activities, this is just another way to get to the daily activity tab that was shown earlier in the video. Your grades, if you click on your grades, this will show you all of your grades and all of your current courses. And here is the calendar. When we click on the calendar, each day that there is work assigned, there will be a dot, a colored dot that shows up to indicate that there is work due in a class. By clicking on that specific date, you can see what graded work is going to be due on that date to help you with navigating and making sure you are completing work in a timely manner. You're able to navigate backward to see past assignments and forward to see any new upcoming assignments that have been given a due date. This is a good way to make sure that you are turning in graded work on time each day. Our next video will cover navigating the gradebook.